Forest Hills Public Schools has raised its starting pay for bus drivers to $21 an hour as a way to address a national shortage. He says Kyle Mitchell explains what led up to the change. Brian, and Sue, the district says the pay increase was needed to stay competitive with fewer drivers to go around. Getting behind the wheel of the big yellow bus may now be needed more than ever before. In all of my years, I would have never dreamed that we would ever come to the point where we would actually share with the family, I'm sorry, but we cannot get your children to and from school. Todd Sharp, the director of transportation at Forest Hills Public Schools, says a national shortage of drivers has left buses sitting idle in the lot. We've parked anywhere from oh, a couple bus routes to, I believe, nine a week this last year due to the shortage of bus drivers. Sharp says this left them no choice but to raise pay. Our starting pay when I arrived here at Forest Hills a couple years ago was in the $16 range. Our drivers now start at $21 an hour. The district is also providing a $1,500 sign-on bonus along with paid training and covering the testing costs for a commercial driver's license. We have had several interested um, people apply. We're in the training process now for some of those drivers, but uh, we still would love to have, you know, eight, ten more additional people. Existing drivers are receiving a pay raise with the hope of keeping them in the district and for being hired away by the shipping industry, which is also looking for people with a CDL. The CDL requirements that, that you have to have to drive a school bus, they're very similar to uh, other types of transportation services. And the pandemic has amplified the struggle to find reliable workers. We've had some drivers who have chosen to step away, um, retire a little bit earlier than what they initially had planned. And we've had some drivers who just did not want to be in this setting, um, they just weren't comfortable with the closeness. He hopes the pay bump will help keep buses moving when school starts back up in the fall. We're very hopeful that we will have our positions filled before the start of the school year. If you're interested in applying for a position, we've posted a link in this story on woodtv.com.